Hello everyone, I'm Simon and welcome to Cold Water Tanks. Uh, there's no tanks in the video today, uh, just thought I'd show you some of the creatures I got in uh, some crab traps uh, at one point. The brown snail looking thing is uh, called a sea hare, uh, which is an algae eating sea slug. Pretty cool looking creatures. Uh, a fun thing about this is uh, that when they get startled, they secrete a purple colored secretion that it uses to defend itself from predators. I think I'll probably make a dedicated video about these guys uh, at some point, because they are pretty cool. Uh, all the crabs here are decorator crabs. Uh, as you can see, they use all kinds of macroalgae, uh, sponges and other stuff as uh, camouflage. And this stuff actually grows on their shells. They can be pretty difficult to spot uh, in the right conditions. Uh, I'm guessing this one has just molted, uh, as it hasn't got any stuff growing on it yet. And some of these crabs would have been absolutely perfect for my new crab tank, uh, the Krabby Tat. Uh, but I, sadly I hadn't started the, that tank yet when I got these guys. So all of these were released back into the ocean. Uh, I also got this beautiful looking Norwegian top knot. Uh, I have a few of these in my main tank, but uh, those are all juveniles. And this one is uh, an adult sized fish guessing around 10 centimeters or 4 inches. Uh, they only grow to about 12 to 13 centimeters maximum, uh, which is just under 5 inches. Uh, and they are Europe's smallest species of flounder. They live mostly on rocky bottoms, unlike a lot of flounders. Uh, these guys are among my favorite tank mates, as they are always around. They don't hide a lot, and, uh, and they're just great looking as well. Uh, on top here is a black brittle star, and below some kind of brittle worm, I think. And here we got a juvenile lump sucker, a lump fish, and stuck to one of my floaters. Um, this is how I usually get them. Uh, here we have a small blue rayed limpet stuck to one of my crab traps. These are usually found on kelp, which is a kind of macroalgae that they uh, feed on. Well, that's all for this little video. Uh, if you enjoyed it, please hit the like button. And uh, please leave a comment if you have any questions, suggestions or input of any kind. If you want to see more videos like this or from my other tanks, please subscribe if you haven't already and press the notification bell so you'll be notified whenever I upload a new video. So see you next time, thanks for watching!